Welcome or welcome back on Watch Advisor on YouTube. It's Alexander speaking, your host, and with me, Jean-Claude Monachon, Vice President Omega Product and Customer Service. Hello, Mr. Linz. I'm happy to be today at Omega in the new, brand new Omega Boutique. And the purpose of being here is, of course, to film some novelties. So if you are seeing this video as your first video, please look for the other videos because we have been filming the 321, the Constellation and more videos are available online. And this will now focus on uh, an event in uh, 2021 planned in New Zealand, the America's Cup. Yes. Because Omega, you, with the New Zealand team, you won last time. And so there is a new America's Cup coming in New Zealand, of course, because they are holding it in the country where they won. And you are not only part of the team, but we are official timekeeper of the America's Cup. So we were for the first time um, uh, official timekeeper in 2000 mm -hmm. and also in 2003. And now 2021 will be again official mm -hmm. timekeeper mm -hmm. of this fantastic race. You know, it's mm -hmm. one of the oldest competition in sport. It was the first America's Cup was done in uh, 1851. Mm -hmm. So imagine Omega was three years old. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe and to hit the bell to get our latest notifications. And in case you're doing this for the first time, you have the chance to win one of the Bose noise cancelling headsets each month. We're giving away one of them. Take your opportunity and win the Bose noise cancelling headsets. So I have the pleasure to present you uh, from the Seamaster collection, a Planet Ocean 43.5 millimeters in steel. It's a limited edition of 2021 pieces and you have some USPs on this particular watch equipped by the Calibre 8900 uh, with 60 hours power reserve and the time zone function that is very important I think for people who are traveling. Meaning time zone function that you, when you pull out the crown uh, you can adjust the hour hand in one hour steps. Exactly. I okay. uh, will okay. try to do is the gloves. Voilà. You okay. see it here? So you move from one hour, but yes. you see that the second hand is still keeping the time. Yeah, yeah. So you will not lose one second on your when you are doing this operation in advance or backwards. And the date is also going back and forward. The forward. date, yeah. you can regulate the date with this yeah, function. Okay. Good. Exactly. Okay. Very nice. I really like this extreme contrast. I've seen the watch just uh, some minutes ago the first time. Um, this incredible contrast on that white dial with that blue red is incredible so the it's the color coding of the america's cup yeah the red the blue and the white so we have if you look to the bezel we have a blue ceramic bezel uh, with a hardness of 1200 vickers same process as we do with all our ceramic watches uh, so you have the sintering process, the heating process, the watch shrinks by 25 to 30%. And the after, ceramic. The ceramic. Yeah, yeah. And after you put it in the, in, the, mm -hmm. in the case. And what we do, or what we used to do, if you remember well, we had the Planet Ocean for the uh, Volvo Ocean Race. Mm -hmm. And we had also a color coding and we had the, the colors in rubber. We did the colors in rubber because we couldn't do a white uh, ceramic, a red ceramic into a blue ceramic. It was not possible in three years ago. Now it is. So now mm. what we do, we come and laser engrave the scale, the numbers, and here the part where you have the white and the blue and the, sorry, and the red colors. And we add ceramic, liquid ceramic that has a pigmentation even white or in red. The hardness is a little bit less. It goes, depending on the color, from 500 to 600 liters. So more or less half as hard as the process we use for ceramic usually. Mm -hmm. huh? But you have this matching of colors. And I imagine you don't see uh, any uh there's no area where you see one color sliding into the other. No, no. So it's not. really... It's really totally, if you take a microscope, okay. it's really... Uh, you uh, think it's one straight. piece? 
Yes, you would think it's one piece, exactly. Exciting. Huh? The dial is also in white ceramic. And uh, you have, if you look carefully to the, to the second hand, you will see the old mug of the America's Cup that has been used as a counterweight of wow. the, the watch. Huh? Yeah, I see it. It's cool. You see it? That's very cool. Uh, you, you did it uh, with the Bond watches? Uh, uh, yes, we had 007 written. Uh, we did it once also with the Olympic, uh, Olympic yeah. watches where you had the five Olympic rings. Once also with the second hand. Okay. Technology is improving. Incredible. All the time. All so the it's time. Master Chronometer certified, of sure. course. Yes. Five years latest, warranty, 15,000 Gauss, yes. Latest generation of movements. Yes. Um, and you have a nice uh, engraving also on the case bottom. It's a see-through case bottom. But uh, you have the old mark again. Old and mark and the uh, 36 America's Cup, and Auckland 2021. Uh, voilà. Uh, okay. Waterproof at 600 meters, yeah. tested at 850. Let me be a, a little bit of a devil. What happens if uh, by, uh, you, you never know, the America's Cup doesn't happen in 2021, but it is postponed to 2022. Will the limitation then be 2022 pieces? No, no, <laughs> uh, uh, no, no, <laughs> no, no, you know, we have, we had the same problem with, uh, I, I, don't, I don't wish anyone, yeah, but no, you no. never know. We, we have the same uh, issue with the Olympic Games in Tokyo. Mm -hmm where we have still a model coming for 2020 and now it's postponed to 2021. But the Olympic Games of Tokyo will be called 2020. 2020. Okay. So we don't have to change anything. Something that I have to add is you see these colors, uh, why we did that. Huh? Sailing. You for the sailing. You imagine you are on the boat, on the sailing, on the racing boat. That's where I want to be in 2021. Okay, maybe With we you. go. Maybe yeah, yeah. it would be great. Uh, so we are flying to. <laughs> I have some. I have viewers uh, in New Zealand that have asked me to come to New Zealand, and uh, I'm coming. So you know, usually if you have a race, you have the the line that yeah. you uh, that you have to cut five minutes. So you have the start, and you have five minutes or. 10 minutes to go through the through the virtual line okay so here what we did you present. we have yes and but there is a, a problem big problem big problem that is not a problem because we just heard uh, two weeks ago from the america's cup that the start at the america's cup will be three minutes so and here i have five minutes ten minutes so no matter, because this watch will be also used for other sailing races where you have sometimes five minutes, sometimes you have seven minutes, sometimes you have nine or but ten minutes. But you can adjust whatever you so want. You, exactly, you're right. So let's say it's three minutes. So I will put my, my uh, Depending display on you. in front of the, yeah. voila, of three minutes before the start, you have the, the minute hand. Yeah. And of course, you have to be ready when the minute is at the start. Mm. And when you start the race, you have you can use it as a chronograph because you will measure the time from the the little arrow where it's written start, and you will count your time, adding of course the ten minutes. Still, as a kind of a backup, because of course on those high tech boats we have some pretty uh, sophisticated digital equipment that will also provide exactly. the same information. But if the equipment fails, you use your Omega watch and you and have you have the X33 that is used by oh, team just just to to stay uh, with two feet on the ground. Of course, those boats do have lots of uh, technical equipment. Incredible, yes. yeah, yeah. yeah. Is there going to be a watch also for the uh, New Zealand team boat coming? I see that next time. Okay, there's a uh, watch coming for the New Zealand <laughs> boat. Not. I don't know. I didn't yeah, say uh, this will probably be not be <laughs> blue and uh, probably, if you remember the boat, it's black. Black, red, and white. Black, black, red. So it will be other colors. So if you say, oh, I'm not into this color, white, uh, it's Mike. I, I, no, I it's love it. It's really your fresh, a fresh. No, it's me. For, yeah. Look. I am wearing my, my Seamaster, you know, my favorite Seamaster, and I try to really match all the colors. Is this orange? I have orange on my shirt. There's blue, there's blue here, there's white, there's white here. I need to get this watch with the right shirt now. <laughs> it's you, my man. colors. Um, uh, probably not the one uh, coming from the New Zealand team that are not so much my colors, but we wait for this one. 
Thanks for watching, Jean-Claude. Thank you very much for presenting to you, the watch. Alexander. And all your comments are very welcome about the new America's Cup watch. Bye-bye.